Hey y'all. So I'm just driving. I had a conversation with my dad earlier about how you can't talk to anybody else's children. Especially when a parent, if it's a parent who's like, don't, you know, why you talking to my child? He ain't, you know, whatever. And that caused the generation of my own down when older people around my grandma's age would say, my generation on down, not everybody in my generation, but you know how it go and, and everybody else's generation. But the generation, they don't speak to the elders. You know, they like, they disrespect for around us. They, I'm driving y'all. They disrespect for around us. They don't speak, you know, like just the negative stuff that you hear older people saying. But the reason of that is because the elders stop talking to the children. The elders stop saying, hey, baby, pick that up and go throw it away over there. Or watch your mouth when you're around me. The elders stop saying that so that way they can avoid conflict with the parent. And down the hill, all these children grow up and now they don't respect their elders because the elders can't talk to them. And when they did, their mom or their dad normally you know but their mom or their dad done said something to the other parent or the other adult that said something to their child but at the end of the day we all are one so if we don't speak to these babies that's gonna eventually take care of us when we get older If we don't talk to them, how are they going to treat us? If they don't respect us, they don't know us. They don't know shit about us, and they've been taught to not give two fucks about us. And this goes to the children, too, the younger generation. Right now, you know, that's like in a... I would say like 18 down, maybe some 20s. But these kids that's killing each other, 14 year olds shooting each other because they ain't been taught to fight. Why? Because either their dad or another man ain't want to fucking teach them how to fight. Because he too busy minding his own business away from a child or the mom. You know? Or just some other, the person, it's not even just the parents, because I already know we go through a lot. We try our best to do what we got to do. But the outside help, that village that helps to raise that child, that if that village ain't speaking and putting in to that child and ain't pouring in, that child ain't got nothing to pour out to that village. And like I said, I was talking to my dad and, you know, he was like, you know, what is this? And he's like, that's the Willie Lynch, ain't it? It is. That's Willie Lynch. Separate the young from the old. The old from the young. Man from the woman. You know how it go. But. He also, my dad was also saying. This generation that's out right now. is that child that the slaves prayed for. That cried out for a child that would come to save them. This is who y'all are 14, 15, 16, 17, 18 year olds. This is who y'all is. This is what y'all here for. Y'all warriors. Y'all have a warrior spirit and y'all are here to rise up to be the fighters because my generation we talk about it and we ready but we still are coming out of the generations before us 
that's been knocked down from drugs, family separations, you know, all of that. But y'all, y'all a new a new slate. The elders ain't really been teaching us, teaching y'all. But if they would have kept the mentality of y'all gonna be the ones that's gonna save us, y'all would have been guided to know who you are and what you're here for. But I'm telling y'all right now, this is what y'all here for. And it's going to happen. The time is going to come. I'm not telling, you know, I'm definitely not saying go out and do the wrong thing. But strategize. We as a people, we have to strategize. We have to make it make sense. If it don't make sense, we're going to keep on running into the same wall. We have to come together all age groups because it's our foundation it's been our foundation oh world our foundation we came into this world we aligned to this world and I'm not saying that some don't some of them don't and I'm not saying that they all bad. And y'all know what I'm saying. But we didn't steal, kill, sicken. We didn't do any of that stuff. To come up. That's their foundation. And it's shaky. It's real shaky right now. But that's the message. I just had that thought. And I wanted to say that to y'all. Especially the younger generation. I want y'all to know that y'all are not just some badass thugs. And that... You know, how the, the derogatory things that you hear older people say, my generation and up for real, say about y'all. Y'all are warriors. That Skip Marley song, Lions, look it up. That's y'all. That's y'all, warriors, lions. It's here, y'all. So we have to come together first. connect back to our ancestors but all right y'all like subscribe like the video if you like what i'm saying however whatever you want to do all right talk to y'all later